Iowa State finished third in the Big 12 last season and made the NCAA tournament for the first time since 2005, but the Cyclones are picked to finish eighth in this season's preseason poll. I definitely think we have a good group of guys, talented players, and a good group of freshman guys coming in. So I, I think, um, I think, you know, we're always underrated, and I think that um, we always play that way. Uh, we always uh, have have a chip on our shoulder, and we're excited to start the season, excited to start playing. So we're going to go out and hope we prove ourselves again. We have a lot of tough guys that uh, can play and um, guys that are committed to winning and committed to the team, so I think that's definitely going to be beneficial for us. The Cyclones must replace three starters. One of those missing is Royce White, a first-round NBA draft pick who was one of college basketball's top all-around performers last season. Not very often you got one guy that leads you in every major statistical category, but I think collectively as a group, uh, we have guys that uh, take a lot of pride in how they play. And uh, you know, we'll, have, we'll play more conventional this season. We'll have a pure point guard again, where last year we didn't. And you know, we had a six, eight, 270 pound player bringing the ball down the court a lot of times and being our main facilitator on offense. Uh, so to, ha to have that piece again with Corey uh, and have the athletes, you know, not only to run to the rim, but also to get out wide and run the lanes, uh, and we got guys that can shoot it. You know, if we space the floor properly and play unselfish and make the extra pass, uh, we'll be a very good offensive team. We have a lot of good guys that can, um, can put the ball in the basket, and I think that shooting will be one of our great um, attributes this year, and um, I think that working hard, we'll, we'll, we'll always always go hard, always go hard to the end of the game. One thing I know for sure is these guys are going to leave it all out on the floor, and, and that's one thing I love about this group of guys. I don't have to go out and coach effort every day in practice. You know, they're bringing it, and they're pushing each other, and they're making each other better, uh, and that's what it's all about. I think this group will come out and I think we'll surprise some people.